Hey guys, this is Henry from Obedia again. Today we're going to be giving you an overview of the track list in Studio One. So let's say you have a Studio One song already created and you are located on your main window where you can see your timeline and your waveforms. As you can see, um, right now we have a track called Piano. It's an audio track. Then we have a virtual instrument. It's called Synth. Another one, which is a Mai Tai, and then we have a folder track, Loops, that contains two audio tracks. So, um, w the track list in Studio One, uh, typically, by default, it won't be showing, it'll be hidden, but you can show it on the top left corner. There is this little icon that has three horizontal lines. That's your track list. If you click there, you're going to see your track list on the left it's going to open as a tab on your left side, uh, on the left side of the screen. So this is very useful because it gives you really nice information about your tracks. Like for example, well, the first thing it tells you it's the track number. As you can see, piano is number one, which we can confirm by looking at the piano. And then there's a number one here. Sorry. Uh, same thing for the synth, number two, number three. If you click on any of these numbers, you'll be selecting those tracks, just as if you actually clicked on the track. Another cool thing about this, you can see the color. For Let's say, for example, the Mai Tai red. It's here red, you can see it, so it's the same color there. This window also, or this tab, this track list tab, also tells you the type of track that you're dealing with. For example, the first track, the piano, you can see that little icon that looks like a small sine wave that tells you that's an audio track. But then on the synth and the Mai Tai, you can see that little icon that looks like a little piano that tells you that's a, that's a virtual instrument. And then you can see, for example, the loops track. You see a little folder that tells you that's a folder track. And then within that folder, you have the loop one and loop two tracks, which they are audio tracks because you see the little sine wave icon next to it. So this pretty much tells you inside the loops track, there are two tracks, one called loop one and the other one called loop two, and both of them are audio tracks. Another cool feature about this window, you can uh, hide or show individual tracks by clicking on the little white or the little gray circle next to it for ex and as soon as you click on it the track will be hidden. Let's try that with the piano track. So if I click on the little uh, gray uh, circle it's now hidden and since it's hidden you can see it's grayed out. If I click back on it I can see it again. Um, another cool and last feature about this at the bottom you can see that Audio tracks, that little waveform icon, it's blue, which means that all the audio tracks are being shown. Also, the instrument tracks, that little icon is blue, which means that all the instrument tracks are being shown. And the same for the little folder icon. And when it's blue, all the folder tracks will be shown. If you click, for example, on the audio tracks button, then all the audio tracks will be hidden. Just by clicking once, every single audio track will be hidden, like the piano, the loop one, and the loop two track. So you could do that, or you could go one by one and hiding the actual tracks. Same thing for virtual instruments or folder tracks. So that's the track list overview in Studio One. I hope this tutorial was helpful for you guys. If you have any other questions, please call us from Obedia at 615-933-6775. Thank you very much. Bye-bye. Today's pro audio hardware and software can give you excellent results if you know how to use it properly. Obedia can help you to get the most out of your pro audio hardware and software. Why spend your time scouring the internet for answers or digging through manuals? With one quick call to an Obedia technician, you'll be connected with someone who can give you the answers that you need in real time via phone and remote desktop. Obedia technicians are trained in all major digital audio applications on Mac, PC, iOS, and Android devices. Obedia member subscriptions are cost effective, give you great member benefits, and Obedia is here seven days a week to help you get the most out of your digital audio hardware and software. No matter what your level of expertise, Obedia can help you to stay focused and productive and get your music back on track. Start taming your technology today with Obedia.